Hi, I'm Teresa. And I'm Marge. And this is a love letter to my grandmother. Uh, my mom has decided to join me again. It is December, and a traditional drink in December is... Eggnog. Eggnog. So we're going to make an eggnog recipe that I found in Grandma's <laughs> recipe box. Um, it's called chocolate eggnog, which I thought sounded good. What do you think? Yeah. Sounds good. Uh, this is a recipe that I found in a magazine that gra that grandma or great grandma had or Minnie had cut out. Somebody had cut out, and um, the description in the recipe by the magazine is it's strictly top hat. So I think that means it sounds good. What do you think, Mom? I think that's what it means. And they also said it's delicious and nutritious and highly recommended for children and adults alike. No booze, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, there's no booze. Um, so the first uh, step is to take two cups of milk and six tablespoons of chocolate syrup and heat them up together. So I'm going to take my, six, my two cups of milk and my six tablespoons of chocolate syrup and heat those up together. Uh, it doesn't say what temperature, so I'm going to assume kind of a, a medium or a, to low, low to medium heat. Does that sound good to you, Mom? Yep. Okay. So I'm going to just move this chocolate syrup in there, and we'll start heating that up. And in a small bowl, we are supposed to uh, combine the well-beaten egg yolks, which I already did, with the water, sugar, and vanilla. And you can see that I have all of those things already mixed. The Well, the eggs are beaten and they're all ready to be mixed. So you want to take the egg, the egg yolks, the water, the sugar, and the vanilla and put them all together. And I will heat this. Did you ever make us eggnog when we were kids, Mom? I think I usually bought it. Yeah, that's what I remember. A carton of eggnog in the fridge. That's okay. I don't have a problem with that. So go ahead and mix all those together for us, Mom. And then I am to slowly add that to the milk mixture that we've got on the stove. All right, I'm gonna mix that with my spoon real quick because that sugar isn't really dissolving very well. Okay, so slowly adding this to my chocolate milk mixture. And it says to heat for two minutes on low heat but do not boil. I've never made eggnog before, Mom, have you? Yes, but I found it's too thin. Yeah, this looks really thin. I was thinking in the supermarket that it's thicker. Does that mean I should add flour? No. No? <coughs> How do you make it thicker? Heavy cream? Yeah. Heavy cream. Heavy cream. Half and half. Half and half. You know, Eric really likes coffee, but he never buys half and half for his coffee. If he did, then we could put that in here. But he doesn't. All right, so two minutes on low. Now in a separate bowl, we are supposed to Beat the egg whites and powdered sugar together. So I got our egg whites, I got our powdered sugar. I'll do that over here. So mom, there are no instructions on how you're supposed to beat the egg whites. So I made them nice and kind of frothy looking. What do you think? Sound good? I think it sounds good. Okay. Looks very thin, doesn't it? Yeah, I don't know how much the egg whites will thicken it. Well, actually, it says just put the egg whites on top, like 
a little frothy topping. Like as whipped a, cream on top of... Yeah, but instead something. of whipped cream, it's egg whites. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> How does that sound to you? Does that sound top pat? All right. Well, I wouldn't go to this much trouble for it myself. For eggnog, you just buy it in the supermarket? Yeah. I'm going to cook it a little bit longer. All right, shall we try it, Mom? Okay. All right, so with the... Maybe you could sit down. Okay, what the instruction says is that we pour them into tall glasses or mugs. And then we uh, top it with the the egg, egg whites. whites. Yeah. So and nutmeg. And nutmeg. Yes. So I don't know. I thought I'd use a ladle just to be a little more tidy. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Let's try this. Mm. Ah, it's good. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like the smell of the nutmeg well, in there too. It's not what you would expect. <coughs> Good job. It's very thin. Is that why you say it's not what you would expect? Right. I don't know. I haven't had any of the egg whites yet, but every time I take a sniff, it just totally smells like eggnog to me, even though I don't think it has a super eggnoggy taste. No, it doesn't have an eggnoggy taste. Mm -mm. No, it tastes more like hot chocolate. But it sure smells like eggnog in there. I think it's because I haven't had any egg whites yet. Alright, well, Merry Christmas from, here, from us here at A Love Letter to My Grandmother. Bye! Bye.